Hello everyone, welcome to Charlie Cook. Today we are making healthy vegetable idlis in microwave. It is a very simple 5 minutes recipe so it's quick, healthy and easy and also tasty. For this you require idli batter, some fresh vegetables and microwave safe idli maker. So let's start. So we're gonna start by taking 4 cups of idli batter. To that we are going to add vegetables, we are going to start by adding half cup of finely chopped carrot, half cup finely chopped capsicum, one fourth cup of finely chopped onions, one fourth cup of finely chopped coriander, one teaspoon of ginger paste and finely chopped chilies. You can pretty much add in any vegetables of your choice. Next we are adding salt to taste. And now let's mix it together. So this is how the batter looks and this is the consistency required. Now let's prep our idli maker. We are going to add in 2 cups of water. So now we are going to take these idli molds and we are going to grease it with some oil. So now after greasing we are going to fill in with the batter. So now we have filled both our molds. Now let's place in our molds and now cover it. So now we are going to keep it in the microwave for 4 minutes. So after 4 minutes they are nicely cooked and fluffed. Now let it cool down in the molds for few minutes. So here we have demolded the idlis and there you go, your microwave idli is ready. It looks really tasty and it is colourful, it is very healthy. You can make it in your breakfast or have it as a snack, it's nice. Serve it with coconut chutney or coriander chutney. The vegetable gives a very nice crunch and flavour to the idlis. So if you like this video, do thumbs up and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye. Hello everyone, welcome to Shabby Cook. Today we are going to learn how to make rice in microwave. It is very simple, just few easy steps and your rice is cooked. So to begin with the rice, here we have took about one and half cup of basmati rice. You can pretty much take any rice of your choice. The first step is to wash the rice thoroughly 4 to 5 times with water until the water is less cloudy. Next you gotta soak the rice in the water for 30 minutes. Third step is to drain that water and here we get the rice. Now to the soaked rice we are going to add about 3 cups of water. So the proportion of rice and water we here is whatever amount of rice you take, you gotta take double the amount of water. So as we have took about one and half cup of rice, to that we have added double amount that is three cups of water. To that we are going to add one teaspoon of oil. You can also use clarified butter or just the butter. Just give it a swirl. Oil helps to enhance the flavor of the rice and make it more better. Cover it with the lid and now we are going to microwave it for about 10 to 12 minutes. This is the rice after 12 minutes. Now to perfectly cook the rice we are going to keep it uncovered into the microwave for more 5 minutes. So now the rice is all perfectly cooked. This is just my little trick that I like to use when I microwave the rice. So there the rice is ready to be served. You can see it is very nicely cooked, beautiful, soft, fluffy and you can see it's nice and separate. So there you go, make this very simple microwave rice and enjoy it. If you like this video, do thumbs up and subscribe. Hey everyone, welcome to Shadakut. Today we are making really quick chocolate cake in mug. 
This is a really simple and quick recipe and it requires really less ingredients. So to start with, we are going to need a microwave safe mug. So we are going to start by adding 3 tablespoons of all purpose flour. Next I am going to add 3 tablespoons of powdered sugar. Next I am adding 1 and half tablespoon of cocoa powder. Next 1 4 teaspoon of baking powder. I am just going to give it a mix so that everything is combined well. Next I am adding 2 tablespoons of butter. This is melted butter. Next half teaspoon of vanilla essence. 3 tablespoons of milk. And lastly I am going to add 1 tablespoon of choco chips. Now I am going to mix it well until it's nicely combined and choco chips are just going to give a very nice chocolatey inside. So here is the consistency you can see. This is the consistency you need. So now I am going to microwave it for 2 minutes on high. And then we are going to check if it's properly cooked. So after 2 minutes our chocolate cake and mug is ready. My oven took 2 minutes but it really depends upon different microwave ovens so keep an eye on it. To check if your cake is properly baked or not, all you need to do is just insert a toothpick in the cake. If it comes out clear, that means your cake is baked. Now I'm just going to sprinkle some powdered sugar on the top. Let it cool down for a bit to set. Now let's see how it is from inside. Wow, you can see it is nice and moist. It has a very nice consistency. And there is that nice chocolatey layer of chocolate chips. This is really perfect. So there you go, your really quick 2 minutes chocolate cake in mug is ready. Hey everyone, welcome to Shada Cook. Today we are making really quick 5 minutes Oreo cake in microwave. This recipe requires really less ingredients which are easily available at home. So let's start. So here we are going to start first by blending about 25 Oreo biscuits. So now we are going to blend it together until it's in a powder form. Now to this I'm going to be adding 3 teaspoons of powdered sugar. Next I'm adding 1 teaspoon of baking powder. Now I'm just going to give it a real quick mix. Lastly I'm going to be adding 1 and 1 fourth cup of milk. Make sure all your ingredients are at room temperature. Now mix it well. So here I have lined my microwave safe bowl with some butter paper. In case you do not have butter paper, all you can do is just apply some butter on your mold and sprinkle some flour. This will just avoid the cake from sticking to the mold. Now I am going to pour in the batter. Now I am going to put it in the microwave for 5 minutes. So after 5 minutes our cake is ready. Now all I am going to do is just insert a toothpick in the cake. If your toothpick comes out clear that means your cake is properly baked. Now I am going to let it cool down for a while. So the cake has cooled down completely and the cake is ready. Now I am just going to remove the paper. And you can see it has come out so perfect and moist. So now I am going to quickly decorate my cake. So here I have made a hot stencil just to decorate my cake. To make this stencil all you need to do is just draw a heart shape on the piece of paper and then cut out the heart shape and there you get a very simple heart stencil. Now I am going to sprinkle some powdered sugar in the heart. Now I am going to carefully remove the paper. So there you go our beautiful Oreo cake is ready. It has come out really nice and moist. It smells like cookies and milk. So give it a try and let us know how does it comes out. If you like this video do thumbs up and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. Hey everyone, welcome to Shada Cook. Today we are making a really simple 2 minutes brownie in mug. For this real quick recipe, firstly we are going to need a microwave safe mug. So first we are going to start by adding 4 tablespoons of all purpose flour. Now to this we are going to add 4 tablespoons of brown sugar. 
Next we are adding 2 tablespoons of cocoa powder. Now I am going to mix it well. Once my dry ingredients are well combined, next I am going to add 2 tablespoons of melted butter. Next I am going to add 1 fourth cup of milk. Make sure all your ingredients are at room temperature. Now I am going to mix it well. So this is just the consistency you can see. Now it's ready to be go in the oven. For the final touch I am just sprinkling some choco chips on the top. This is an optional step. Now I am going to microwave this for 2 minutes at high temperature but it really depends on different microwave ovens so you must keep an eye on it. So after 2 minutes our microwave brownie is ready and mugged. This looks really tasty and it came out really perfect. Now let's dig in and see how is it from inside. Wow! The bread has came out really perfect. It is nice and fudgy. It's just perfect like brownie. It tastes really good and it took just 2 minutes to make this cake. We have many other microwave cakes which are ready in just 5 minutes on our channel Shada Cook. If you like this video, do thumbs up and subscribe. Give it a try and let us know how does it comes up. Thank you so much for watching. Bye bye.